Hi, welcome to my channel. I'm Jamshid Baig, known as JB the Adventurer, a solo traveler and a travel blogger from Manchester, England, with over 30 years of travel experience. I have traveled to over 70 countries so far and now ready to share those wonderful adventures with you. In today's adventure, I'm going to tell you about the historic visit of British Queen Elizabeth II to Savat Valley and also show you the very place where Queen Elizabeth stayed during her historic visit in 1961. The picturious Savat Valley tucked away between mountains and thick green forest in the northwest of Pakistan was first visited by the Duke of Edinburgh, Prince Philip, in 1959. Two years later, President Ayub Khan invited Queen Elizabeth to visit Pakistan and following Prince Philip's previous trips, she accepted on the condition that they would travel to Savat. The Queen and Duke of Edinburgh landed in Karachi in February 1961, where they were welcomed by the Nawab of Kalabagh, then the governor of West Pakistan. They attended a series of welcome ceremonies, drove through Karachi in an open vehicle. visited the tomb of the founder of Pakistan, Muhammad Ali Jinnah, and then attended a garden party at Government House in Karachi. In the evening, President Ayub Khan hosted a banquet for the Queen. The next stop was Peshawar and the northwest frontier, where the Queen and Duke visited the Khyber Pass and attended a banquet at Governor house in Peshawar. In February 1961, Savat was hit by one of the harshest winters, but thousands of people stood alongside the road to catch a glimpse of the Queen. The Queen travelled in one of her roofless cars. It was an American automobile from the fleet of the Wallier Savat. The Queen was very enthusiastic as she waved to the cheering crowd. Due to heavy snow, some of the roads were blocked, preventing the Queen from visiting some of the more remote areas of Savat Valley. The Savat Valley has an archaeological site dating back to the Buddhist and Gandhara civilizations, which greatly interested the Queen at the time. The former valley of Savat had preserved all the archaeological sites and set up a modern museum in Mangora, where some are historic relics, statues and artifacts were put on display. This museum was later damaged following the Taliban insurgency in 2007. This is the place where Queen and Duke of Edinburgh stayed during their visit to Savat Valley. The ruler of Savat Valley had this beautiful building constructed to host the guests of the state. The place is beautifully furnished and decorated with historical photos hanging on the walls of these beautiful hallways. The historic picture of coronation of last Valiye Savat, His Highness Mengol Jahanzeb, along with first Prime Minister of Pakistan, Liaquat Ali Khan, and his wife Begum Rana Liaquat Ali Khan. A rare photograph of Queen Elizabeth visiting Savat during her visit to Pakistan in 1961. She is flanked by Prince Philip, who accompanied her during the visit, and Mangol Jahanzeb Khan, the last Wali of Savat. historic photo of Mangol Abdul Badud known as Bacha Khan. Another historic and rare photograph of first Prime Minister of Pakistan Liaquat Ali Khan, First Lady Begum Liaquat Ali Khan along with Wali Savat, Mangal Yahzeb and his father Bacha Khan. Time to go and see the very room where Queen had stayed during her visit. The room is spacious and beautifully decorated with Victorian style wooden furniture.
The room also has a spacious walking-in dressing room. and a luxurious Victorian style bathroom. The beautiful wooden high ceiling of the room is adding a perfect look to the room. We had the pleasure to stay and enjoy the hospitality of this place for a couple of nights, which is an incredible experience. I would like you to join my cause to showcase the nature, beautiful landscapes, diverse cultures, great hospitality and over 3000 years of rich history of Pakistan and show the world that Pakistan is a safe country to visit. You can play your part by just clicking the like button and sharing this video as much as possible and hit the subscribe button so you don't miss any future adventures. See you next week with a new adventure. Ciao!